I almost didn't get out of bed today. I was feeling this urge to just lay down and snuggle and just don't do anything because the weather is so windy and it's perfect to just chill. But nope, not doing that. At least in little ways, I need to be productive. But of course, this video blog is not complete if we don't sing together inside my car, Ben. What's the music? Oh, yeah. Sure. I borrowed this mat today because I realized that I forgot my mat in the other studio yesterday. So we're gonna have to drive there and get it. Oh my God, that mat has sentimental value for me because I bought it in San Francisco when I was traveling there in 2013. So I'm hoping it's still there. It says traffic on my route is slightly heavy. So hopefully we get there on time. Traffic, boo. It's not inside. They can't find it. Where did I leave my yoga mat? I remember I did yoga yesterday in the studio and then went to the library, but I didn't bring it with me in the library. And so, oh, what a bummer. I love that mat. We're driving to Walmart right now because I need to look for a new mat. I cannot go on without a mat. It's like my other half it's my best friend and in a quarter mile turn right onto community road yes ma'am yep we're gonna go look for a new mat there we go so we're gonna look for something cheaper and nicer hmm what color what brand this one is the cheapest they have. It's $4.97. But the thing is, I don't like the color. I'm not a neon green person. And the one below right here is $7.97. It's got a cool print. And I got a purple one right here. So I think I'm going to go for this one. Slightly more pricey, but at least I like the design, right? I'm still thinking where I left my yoga mat. I got a new one, so it's good, but of course I'm still grieving over the loss of my other one. I'm hoping it turns up somewhere. I know that you probably think it's just a mat, Jamie. Why the hell am I so bothered? But hey, it's got sentimental value. It's been with me forever. It's traveled with me a lot. So I'm feeling a little bummed that it it's lost i have to learn how to apply yoga principles which is the art of detachment kasi may tendency ako na ganito i like getting attached to things or to people it just depends if i share a good experience or a good feeling with a certain thing or a person i have this tendency to get attached like see with my cars as well i'm like that that's why i name my cars because i see them as like my babies and same thing with best friends and my ex-lovers i get really attached and it's so hard to let go so i think this is a simple way of learning how to let go and detach and you know what if it comes back if i find it great if not it's okay we had great experiences but oh well when I check my car, it's not here. And normally, I I bring it here. And I even watched yesterday's episode in, in YouTube. And I saw that on the way out of my practice, I wasn't carrying any mat in the video. And so I'm, I'm very sure I left it there. But it's not there, though, when I checked. What a bummer. But you know what? It's okay. Let's live in the present. Let's be thankful I found another mat and we're alive and I'm still able to do my practice. And thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Let's learn the art of detachment and learning to be happy with whatever is here. Be careful, it's Friday the 13th today. I think I got my, my thing. <laughs> oh well, falafel. 
I'll see you again tomorrow. It's gonna be an exciting episode because I'll be going to LA. And remember, Jamie wins. So can you. Take it easy now. Adios.